deep within each of us is the realization that we were designed for so much more. There's a longing to know and to be fully known. We all share the same dilemma. We long for life and we're not sure where to find it. But God has hardwired us with this desire. He has designed us to be in the greatest love story of all time. Jesus said that he goes to prepare a place for us and that he will come to fetch us so that we can be with him. So while these days on earth are much like camping, open to the elements, the storms, the wind, we look forward to a real house with real walls where we will finally sigh and say, this is where I'm supposed to be. This is what I was made for. In the meantime, we are on a journey of desire. We long for our bridegroom to come for us. The Feast of Tabernacles is a rehearsal for that day. We dance and sing and praise Him, looking to that union with Him that we crave, that feeling of being finally complete. Living in the tense of this life, we cling to hope. We groan inwardly, but we wait eagerly and as spring follows the winter, we'll soon hear the watchman on the wall shouting. We hear a distant music and it comes with fuller swell. Tis the triumph song of Jesus, of our King, Emmanuel. Zion, go ye forth to meet him, and my soul be swift to bring all the sweetest and the dearest for the triumph of the King.